Testing, testing. Hello, Mario. Hope you're doing well. Uh, this Bitbucket repo stuff is fairly new. I mean, within the past six months or so, so I'm not an expert either, but I'm going to show you what I've found as far as teams and repo ownership and all that sort of stuff. It, it gets confusing. I'm creating a new repository as myself. All uh, right. So let's get that created and you can see it's assigned to me instead of one of the teams that I'm on. So I'm going to create that repository. Now once the repository is set up, you can transfer any existing repository, go to settings and it is under transfer repository and you should be able to transfer it to any owner. And if you type in my store locator plus, you should be able to get my SLP. I think you should be able to just do like that as well. My SLP is the owner name. Once you transfer this, you lose ownership. So make sure there are no typos here. If you do not assign this to an existing user, who knows where it goes, you cannot get it back. So for that repo you're having an issue with, you should be able to transfer ownership. And then it will be set here. You can pick the project and it tells you what the settings are for this particular user account for My Store Locator Plus and accept it. Now once that's done, it will be in the My Store Locator Plus team uh, ownership. And you can see I have teams for three different sections here and I should see that now if I go to the team My Store Locator Plus and there it is. So that's all you need to do to get that over there if you want to put it in there. Um, so I don't, I see where you created a repository here. So anyway, that's how you change it. Hopefully that'll help you get it transferred over.